Information theory is the branch of applied mathematics involving the quantification of information. Information is a message that consists of an ordered sequence of symbols or the meaning that can be interpreted from it. Information theory was first developed by Claude P. E. Sharon while researching the fundamental limits on signal processing in 1948. This study was a purely statistical study with no regard for the content or meaning of the information. It produced a measurement of information called the bit. The full concept is illustrated in this chart includes a source of information which produces the message. The message then in turn is converted by a transmitter into a signal. It is at this point the noise can degrade the signal, causing a loss of information. The signal is then picked up by a receiver so that the message can then be sent to its destination. One form of information storage is what's called analog. Analog information storage involves storing information by mimicking the pattern of the incoming signal. This is a final record which uses grooves in the record to store sound patterns. These are audio cassette tapes which use magnetic patterns to store sound patterns. Digital information storage stores sound patterns and other types of data as symbolic, usually numerical, representations. CDs use physical patterns within the CD to store digital patterns of sound and data. DVDs use physical patterns within the DVD to store digital patterns of video and other data. This is a hard drive, one of which is probably inside the computer you are watching this on. It uses magnetic patterns to store digital data. This is a USB drive. It stores digital data electronically on microchips. The following are examples of even older digital information storage systems. Books like the King James Bible, which contain information digitally encoded in the form of letters and words. DNA is the digital information storage system of living cells. DNA contains information digitally encoded in four base pairs commonly denoted by A for adenine, P for thymine, E for cytosine, and G for guanine. Together they form the densest encoding system of information known. There are various ways of transmitting information. The most common form of human transmission of information is sound. Information can also be transmitted visually. This uses visual observations of patterns to send information. The following are two well-known forms of visual transmission of information. Semaphore, which uses flags moved in patterns to form an alphabet to send information. Smoke signals use smoke patterns to send information. They became famous because of their use by American Indians. Radio waves are low-frequency electromagnetic waves that are commonly used to transmit information. The transmission of information by radio involves encoding it into a signal that gets transmitted by radio waves to a receiver. The receiver then converts the signal back into a recognizable form of information. Information technology is the acquisition, processing, storage, and dissemination of information by computing and telecommunication. It is the basis of the Internet and much of modern business data handling processes. In conclusion, information is an important part of life in the 21st century. And in the form of DNA, information is absolutely necessary for life to exist at all. So as a result, the encoded systems of our information literally make life possible.